My name is Neil. I'm neither young nor old. I'm an artist. I don't paint, sculpt, or take pictures. I sing. I moved to New York six years ago in search of a better life, for the fulfillment of a dream. Sure, there was the allure of fame and success, but as I've gotten a little older, I've realized that I have to sing. It's what I do best. But singing is not enough. I've stood on famous stages like Carnegie Hall with famous people, Sting, Billy Joel, James Taylor, Sheryl Crow, and even a Beach Boy. I've sung in front of the President and First Lady, honoring Diana Ross and Brian Wilson at the Kennedy Center. I sang on the theme song for 30 Rock and have done other episodes with Cyndi Lauper, Elvis Costello, Mary J. Blige, and the Beastie Boys. Oh, yeah. I get called to sing background, off camera, on Saturday Night Live and roam the halls with famous guests like Eva Longoria and Zac Efron. He's so cute. I sing with Rachel Ray's husband and party with famous people. I've played with Dolly Parton on Letterman, Conan, Good Morning America. But do these people really even know that I'm there? That I'm even in the room? Room, room. I've sung with orchestras in Turkey and in a rock and roll soul choir. At pharmaceutical drug launches to hungry salespeople chomping at the bit to get out there and sell the next wonder drug that helps people sleep or wake up or stop eating, whatever. I've starred in musicals about Jesus. I'm either zero degrees or one degree of separation from some of the world's most famous people. But I wonder if people even see me as an artist. Or am I now just a background singer? Is this all we are? Our resume, our jobs, our unfulfilled desires? Is this what defines us? Is this how the world sees us? Better yet, is this how we see ourselves? Sure, my job is fine, and don't get me wrong, I'm very appreciative. But one thing that keeps me up at night There's got to be more.